hi guys so this is a video of me going back home after three months <laughs> yes guys i was away from my house for three months um mental health is very very important guys let's take care of our mental health i took a break from everything i took a break from my daily activities i took a break from my house just to go and heal from some things that really broke me down and um yeah today's the day i'm going back and i know my house is so dirty so i passed by the supermarket to buy some cleaning items some detergent before i get to the house so guys this was the state of my house when i came back it was so so dirty and wow i had missed my home i had missed my you know this is my personal space i had missed it so much i was actually staying with a good friend of mine she took care of me she took good care of me she was an angel sent by the heavens i'm telling you guys we need to have friends whom we can lean on for support during such times um, I stayed with her and her kids for the whole period I was away. And uh, yeah, everything, I healed so nicely. In fact, I have added so much weight because, <laughs> you know, when you have uh, trustworthy and loyal friends, people who are actually ready to go all the way out for you, you tend to, um, you know feel a lot of peace and with a lot of peace of course comes good health i wanted so much weight but i'm not complaining actually i'm so thankful for her and guys see how this house is so dirty yo anyway yeah i have been operating from her house for the whole period uh working on projects near the cbd yeah she lives near the cbd so it was uh, easier for me to operate from her house uh, i was working on a few projects here and there also had some exams to do i was actually swamped with so many activities to do so it was um, so nice of her to take me in and uh, you know stay with her during all this time you know maybe one of these days i'm going to do a sit-in video and we're going to talk about how i healed how i went uh, whatever my experience during the whole period whatever happened to me to put me in that state yeah we are going to talk about all these things um i feel like uh me sharing will actually help someone or Maybe there could be somebody who will relate to my situation and it could help them heal too, you know, pull themselves out of, you know, the dark space. Anywho, this, is, this was uh, me getting settled into my home once again after a long three-month period. So once again, guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for your support so far. If you are new in this video, uh, make sure you have subscribed. Don't forget to uh, click on the notification bell so that you can be notified whenever I put up a new video. Yeah. Give me a like, a comment, and share whenever possible so that you can help uh, grow this channel. So, of course, the first thing I'm going to do is clean up this house. It's a whole lot of mess. And then later on, if I'm not so tired, I'm going to go out for grocery shopping. There is no food in this house. Like, my fridge is empty. My shelves are empty. And, yeah, I need to get some food for myself. So, let me change. And then I'm going to start cleaning up. 
Let me give you a quick haul of the things I've just bought. So I went to Food Plus supermarket because it's one of the nearest supermarkets I have here. And uh, from there I got these five packets of Indomie. They were on offer and I love Indomie so much. So yeah, I got these ones. These are one, two, three, four, five. And then I got these uh, gloves, cleaning gloves. I also got um, some sponge cloth, disposable of course. Um, I got these uh, paper kitchen towels. And then I got this refuse bag. Yeah. Uh, I bought some um, scouring powder, morning fresh, and a hurricane toilet cleaner. This is a disinfectant from Velvex. And also bought a um, uh, floor cleaner. It's actually a tile cleaner. So this is uh, Mr. Muscle. And then I got this water. I had to buy this small bottle because I don't trust the water on my dispenser. It has been there for three months. Might not be healthy. So of course the first thing I will do is remove the carpet. It was so dusty and I folded it up to give to the guy who was going to do the cleaning for me up next i prepared some cleaning water with a lot of detergent um, and then of course i was going to split it into two buckets where one i will use for cleaning and keep uh, refreshing the water as i went on with the cleaning um i had to pull the seats to get reach uh, the dust that was below and behind the seats i started off with wiping the window seals clean of course i swept and uh, you know just a lot of general cleaning um if you would like to watch the whole video of this cleaning i have a one hour video put up it's a video of the whole cleaning process as it went by and uh yeah, go and support my vid uh, video by liking, commenting, and last but not least, if you have not subscribed, kindly do remember to subscribe. Uh, it really helps the channel grow and, uh, you know, you'll be supporting a sister in this journey. Guys, everything was going so well. Everything was going on schedule until... You know, I could not take it anymore. I had already started having headaches and uh, feeling some type of way. Eventually, I ended up in some clinic. I had to go and get checked up. So, I just came back, guys, and yeah, I, I really don't know what happened. I just came back from the hospital like a few minutes ago, and I'm not feeling so well. I, I don't know what happened. Could be an allergic reaction or I'm coming down with a cold or something. Or maybe it's just fatigue but yeah I had to rush to the hospital because I was feeling um, I was just feeling dizzy uh, with a splitting headache so they have given me some painkillers and uh, they have also managed to do some blood work uh, in the lab and they're testing for malaria and uh, uh, blood infection something like that something of the sort they've given me the dosage for tonight I've already taken it and um, right now I'm just about to have some dinner um, so that I can go and rest entirely until tomorrow where I'll see what I can do because I still have a lot of things to do in this house I need to clear my fridge my you know this uh, most of the electronic appliances in the kitchen I need to clean all of them. I need to clean the curtains. So we'll see how it goes tomorrow. And then, of course, I'm going to update in the vlogs. So for now, I'll just have some dinner and then I'll go and rest until tomorrow. Hi, guys. So I just woke up a few minutes ago. Uh, I'm still feeling a bit groggy, possibly from the pain, from the dose of pain killing medicines I took last night. I was in so much pain, by the way. I'm those type of people who rarely, rarely get sick, but the simplest form of symptom to any kind of flu disease or anything puts me down like I will need a complete bed rest 
from a symptom. I, I'm going to try as much as possible to treat the cold uh, as early as possible so that it does not come, you know, like full impact. So for today, it's just a lot of liquids, a lot of uh, water, a lot of fruits, a lot of vitamin C. I don't want to suffer those symptoms. Yo, it's and it's December. Um, mm, 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 mm. So anywho, um, still having my first uh, cup of coffee. And then I want to unbox some stuff I got from Jumia for the Black Friday. Not so much, just a little small, small things I was buying. So my order was for six items, six small items. And uh, five of them have already are, been delivered. I'm still expecting one. I think it's still being shipped or something. I don't know. I'll track it later. So this is the first item I got. And... Uh, so this is the first item I bought uh, it's a nine colored makeup eyeshadow palette I got this because I want to you know get acquainted with my you know make makeup skills uh, you know I want to be a pro so I thought this is a good palette to start off with oh I love the packaging too so this is how it looks The second item I got mm -hmm. oh. I got this waterless cleanser from Dark and Lovely um, It's supposed to be cleaning scalps without water It's supposed to remove flakes And it's also supposed to eliminate bad odors uh, Especially when you have braids and uh, or wigs and uh, or, you know so this is the second item. Next, so yeah, up next I got these eyebrow shapers. I've never done any eyebrow shaping by myself, so I also want to try and you know, uh, and it comes in a cute bag. Wow, this is so cute and so portable. I love it, I love it, I love it. And guys, remember all these items I got for less than 200 bob. So it was a steal. It was, it was worth. The next item is, I do not know what this is. Let's see. Oh yeah. I got myself a lapel. I got myself a lapel. I want to try this out. Um... Uh, I need to, you know, improve on the voice quality of my videos. So, yeah, I'm so excited. I can't wait to try this out. Oh, my goodness. So, this is how it looks like. It has, like, a small clip to, you know, like, like peg it on your dress or clothing. And then, wow. Okay, I think you connect this to this uh, somewhere in your phone or, or camera. And the last item, my, what was this? I can't remember what this was. Uh, oh, yeah. Ah, it's a mascara. So, the next item was these two in one mascara. Wow. So, it's also. Ooh. These are products I've never used, but I intend to use them for practice. And it was wrapped in so many. It was. Okay, anyway, this is it. Romantic me. It's a mascara. And on this other side, it's an eyeliner. 
and this is how it looks this is the mascara side of it and this is the eyeliner I just can't wait to try them and even practice my makeup skills and stuff so that is it for today I'm still waiting for one more package the last time I tracked it was still being shipped so yeah when it comes of course I'm going to unbox with you guys anywho yeah I think that's the end of this vlog I really need to get my rest and um, also want to go out and buy a lot of fruits for you know because my liquid intake has to increase I'll see you on the next video uh don't forget to subscribe don't forget to give me a like thumbs up don't forget to comment come on support our sister see you on the next vlog guys bye